Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, we're going to be uh, farming a bit of world tier today. Uh, I'm on 40, level 40 world tier. So I'm going to try and get to 15. Um, what map I'm going to do, oh, the quest I'm going to do it from is uh, it's one of the easier farms to do. Um, oh, hang on, I don't want to continue. I'm going to select a story farm, which is on this first city. Uh, we go reach the other side of the river, so we're going to start this. Uh, then we go continue. As soon as you select your story, go continue. Um, yeah, there's other world tier farms you could use, but I find that I, I've tried them and uh, they are a bit bit harder. And if you if your gear isn't up to scratch, you can get overwhelmed by enemies and you lose your world tier if you die. But yeah, this is the uh, one of the fastest ones, and well, it's it's quite fast to go through and. It's one of the. It's, it's it's actually the easiest one out there. It's, um, I mean, I'm on world tier 14. I think I've got about two more runs to do, and then it should hit. Looking at the bar, status bar at the top, I'd say two more runs, and we should hit world tier 15. I've done about seven to get that far up on the uh, status bar. So yeah, let's get on with the video then. So wait, what? I'll, what, ah, what I'll do first is I'll show my gear. What you really want, so. So what I've got loaded up is uh, I've got a light machine gun. I like this because it's got a large clip size. I mean, you can go and mod it to 150, but uh, 100 clip size is, uh, yeah, I like, because the, uh, the mod what I've got is, uh, it's like, um, what's it called? Hang on, it's skills. This is the one you want. Uh, the class I've got is a pyromancer and you get these volcanic rounds so you want that attached because what that does it um, it tells you down here fill your current weapons magazine with bullets that will ignite the air around the enemies and flick bur burn onto them even if a bullet misses it causes skill damage ignoring armor and piercing a target damaging over behind them the skill lasts until you reload or switch weapons so it really does tear through the enemies. Um, but with that, on the light machine gun, you also want um, that per platoon mobile. Because what that will do is if you've got that uh, mod attached, when you get down to 35%, it won't, it won't, uh, it'll just replenish your ammo. So you don't go to a reload. So you constantly got that skill activated. It, it don't go to the cooldown. You'll see in the video what I mean. So, and it really does just rip through the enemies. Um, like I say, like you want something with a big clip, really, because if you if you had something like a shotty with uh, I don't know, like one of these te clip size ten, you've really well, you've really got to get down to thirty five percent, which would be the last three bullets. If you don't get a kill with a bullets, it'll uh, reload and you'll lose your uh, skill it'll go to cool down so yeah something with a large clip with a with a hundred you know you've got a, any any if you get a kill with your last 40 bullets it'll replenish and it's a lot easier it, it, a lot easier to um, you, you're more likely to reload uh, but yeah you'll see in the video anyway so yeah so Let's get on. So when you when you spawn in, you can go straight to the um, the enemies which are over there. But if you take a right, this is what I've always been doing. There is actually a loot crate back here. You might want to just. I mean, it's optional if you want to do it faster. It's um, quite optional. I mean, we've just got a rare there. You, very often you pick up epics, which is uh, quite under. So. You, what I usually do, I've actually gone through this a few times, I've actually made it faster, so what you want to do is rather, I mean you can hang back and uh, clear the enemies out, but what I do is I'll run past them, I'll activate my uh, volcanic rounds already, and what I'll do is, because they're coming swarms, I'll run back to this little fenced off area, and you'll all fire and follow it into this 
area here. We'll just be able to uh, put the light somewhere out. It's like a little tunnel, so we'll be none what can spawn behind you or get behind you. As long as you take them out, just keep an eye on them bullets. Because when it gets to the south side of 5%, you want to uh, make sure one of the bullets is killing an enemy, not the, uh, the fire. Otherwise, you're likely to go down to the cool down. Sometimes you do get that, yeah. yeah. I mean, just running to this point, it, the enemies all spawn at one time, so it's just easy to take it out, take them out. That's what I found, anyway. I mean, you can work your way through the level, but. Uh, And you know when it's clear because that old up blue sign will pop up here. There's also a loot crate here as well, so now we've just got a rare in that, we'll press down to pick up all the loot. And you have this little second area here. Now what I do is rather hold off, rather than hold off and um, take out the enemies. Outrider, we're almost back to your camp. I'll let it dark me eye volcanic How's Jane doing? I'll run. It's two on. places. Um, I'll run to the I first can, place on this first make, run. And then I'll uh, I'll do the second place, which I found is good. So if you run right to the end, all the enemies should spawn out. So get behind him, run up the stairs like this, and let them just follow you up the stairs. It makes a little tunnel, and you can just you can just take them out as uh, they come running up the stairs. Oh, it's quite satisfying actually. Well, just keep an eye on your bullets so you don't waste them and it don't go into full down. It's happened to me a few times. There's not many drops on this. I've usually been getting quite a few efforts, but um here's a field. And it's still coming. I said if you don't want to commit these stairs, there is another little spot as well. It might be faster, I don't know, but uh We've got a legendary there. Yeah, we've got a legendary. First legendary I've picked up on it. Doing this um, World Series farm. I need to do quite a lot better. We do drop a lot of them. So you just take out these last two enemies, then uh, an epic should. So what we'll do is we'll uh, skip that to make it a little bit faster. Activate the volcanic round. Give him one of them in the now, just to weaken him up a bit. Now we've got another kick shot right there. So it's reloaded now, so it just goes back down to the uh, makes the weapon a lot weaker. So you need that replenish, replenish, replenish the uh, bullet. Really good out. So check out the last one in there. Right now you could. Uh, Come down to 
grab your loot. You, now you can restart the uh, campaign, uh, restart this again, or what I usually do is uh, have a look what's inside this loot crate here. There's one at the top of these stairs, another epic, and optional if you want to spend a few more seconds. There's also another loot crate at the back here. I mean, I do, I always like to go and check them out, you know, there might be something decent inside, so if not, you can always dismantle it for scrap or sell it, so. So what we'll do is now, we'll just uh, return back to lobby. Let's have a look at my world tier. Yeah, so looking at that, there's only a tiny bit left. I think next, next go will be, uh, I mean, you can do it a lot quicker than this, it's just because I've been faffing around getting these chest and showing you the mods of the weapons what you really need and the skill skills what you want to really put on I mean this is the pyromancer so but that volcanic bullets I'm I'm guessing this something similar to their uh, uh, that class as well so but I've, I've only tried this pyromancer this is the first playthrough and uh, I haven't tried any other classes so but yeah, so as soon as you're back to the lobby, go back to uh, go back to select storer because you just want to be doing that again. Click on that. Yeah, confirm, and then we we'll continue the game. I apologise, this isn't 4K, but it's because I ain't just took uh, transferred the footage from my Series X. I'm going through my capture card, which can only do 1080p, so. That's why you can hear my whiny voice. But yeah, we'll do that again. We'll go and check this um, this loot crate here. You never know. Might have another epic in there. It might have a legendary. You never know. Like I said, that last one was the first legendary we've actually picked up. In fact, what I'll do is I'm going to have a look at it. So we've got that. that. See, that's a. Uh, close range damage, we ain't too bothered about clip. Let's have a look. Is it slightly better? I reckon it was higher rank in it, but we'll dismantle that. Let's put this legendary on. It's actually weaker, isn't it? So Shall we put it on? Killing a set bonus, killing over melon, it replenish ammunition in your current. See with this, if you've got something like this, it, you can also melee them. If you kill them with your melee, it will replenish the ammunition. So, but I've got that mod on, so I don't think I'm going to do that at the moment. Okay. Anyway, let, let's get back to the uh, let's get back to the uh, last bit. Let's get our world tier 15 unlocked. Like I say, I'll have to activate my uh, volcanic round. Run past these guys here. Like I say, you can hold back and take them out and work your way forward. But I'd just like to uh, run all the way to uh, this little fenced-off area. Just so all the waves are spawned out already. It's just that you haven't got to wait around that little bit for the uh, you know, clearing out bit by bit section and the uh, waves to spawn out. So I think it just saves you a little bit of time. Just be careful because some do get a bit close to you. If you get too much of these enemies, replenish. I didn't think it was going to replenish them. I've got two more. Oh, hang on, no, we're not with some more spawning up at this time. Excellent. 
look how long it takes to do it. Without them going both panic round. So yeah, we'll check out this loot and crate here. Hey, oh! Fucking hell! <laughs> there, there we go, well tier 50. I, I thought I took all them out then. <laughs> My bad, I weren't looking at the uh, map at the top. I thought I took them all out, but sneaky one, he was hiding. So, we'll finish up, we've already hit world tier 15, but we'll... Uh, Outrider, we're almost back to your camp. Copy. How's Jane doing? Barely hanging hanging I'll just show you the I'll second spot I, I usually run to at the end, She'll make it. which I find it's to. quite a decent spot. You know, they can't really get around the back here. And uh, you just got to watch these two enemies what drop here. If you could, uh, if, it, if you get locked, locked in and uh, it's quite easy overwhelming. Yeah, just run in this little hut here. You know, there's a queue up at your front door, trying to get in. Yeah, so you see the clean all up the stairs. That's what I do. Oh, I died! Haha, <laughs> look at... Well, I'm well tier 15 anyway, so, but we'll... Like I said, I think the stairs is probably better. Right, we'll finish this, we'll get back to lobby, we'll go up the stairs again, but yeah. Because they can actually overwhelm you in that little room. It doesn't happen too many times, I think uh, that's the fourth time that's happened. I've actually lost a life on this level. If you can get caught up outside, it's quite easy to get overwhelmed by the enemies and fire. Fucking hell. Of course I'm on world tier 15, and I? That's probably why the enemies are a bit more tougher. Okay, so right, I'm going to go up the stairs this time. Maybe because I'm using the last. I haven't upgraded my weapon. I've upgraded a tier. The uh, enemies are just that slightly harder. Okay. Let's see if we can get go up the stairs. The old face. Slipping down, run up the stairs. Of course, we can back up again as well. Okay. So, what we'll do is we'll go back to the lobby after this and we'll uh, unlock them well tier. Uh, Oh, these are some damage, they do. Just wait for the enemies to...
What the hell? Ah! Oh, okay. Fucking hell, yeah. I think I need a part. <laughs> anyway, I've got to world tier 15, that's the main thing. So, right, okay, I'm gonna have to get a more powerful weapon. So, hang on. Right, okay. So, right, we've got some uh, crates here. I'm world tier, f I've not unlocked these because I wanted to wait till I was uh, get to the top of the. Uh, get to the max out my world tiers so hopefully we get some nice stuff so one where I can go back to there and uh, quite easily do world tier 15 I don't know what it's going to give me but we'll soon find out claim these I suppose it goes into my uh, Has it gone into my, uh... there we go. Oh, we've got a nice legendary there. Yeah. This is what we've got from, we're just opening them um, crates, so I think we'll take a look at them. Got a double gun, automatic shotgun. All right, okay, I'm gonna, Okay, let's return to love it. Yeah, that's the way to, if you want to get to world tier 15, if you, uh, like I say, the other, even even on that level, it's, if you've not got the equipment, you can die quite easily. So, I mean, I've tried some of the other world tier farms and uh, which are going on the internet and I struggled at them. <laughs> I, I think because my equipment, my weapons, they weren't just, you know, I just kept getting overwhelmed and I was getting quite a, a far through and then you just just lose your world tier so world tier what you just gained so I thought I'll go back to the easier level get get my world tier up to 15 and uh, we'll do some expeditions next I think so yeah hopefully this help, uh, video help you out um, you know where to go uh, to make it a little bit quicker for you um, yeah let me know uh, if you find any easier places to do or quicker yeah, put it, put, it, put it down in the comments, let us know. And uh, if you're not a subscriber, click on that subscribe button. We really appreciate all your support. So yeah, hopefully uh, I'll see you again in the next video. Uh, good day to you all.